we are going to take a tour today of the brand new Centurion Lounge here at Hartsfield Jackson Airport in Atlanta. This lounge opened on February 14th, 2024, and it is the largest Centurion Lounge in the world. So let's take a look. The lounge is located at gate E11, easily accessible from any concourse thanks to the plane train. First, we're going to check in. Not much of a line today. The check-in process here is easy. You show your American Express card and your boarding pass, and then they give you a Wi-Fi password, uh, tell you where the bars, restrooms, and the buffet is. Very airy, beautiful entry, lots of greenery, lots of check-in people. This is the first seating area right when you come in. Really beautiful, I love this. It's like an old fashioned library mixed with different luggage. Television with some sports going on. Great big windows. Lots of seating today, not terribly crowded. I'm here right about 11.30 in the morning. Continuing, little separated areas. There's a place over there if you want to work on your laptop. More of the little faux library look. Your departure board. And over here you have coffee, a very nice coffee bar with an espresso maker, regular coffee, tea bar, very nice. And some snacks, fruit, I think that's juices. All right, now we're gonna walk down this way. There's some kind of little recessed seating over there. Here's one of the wonderful outdoor terraces. This part here is under a nice shelter. There are fans out here, also heaters. Absolutely delightful out here right now. Don't know if you can hear me over the plane. But if you love airports as I do and you enjoy watching the planes come and go and just being outdoors on a long day with a long layover, this is wonderful. Again, well thought out with the placement of greenery and plants. Really nice, I feel the heat. Those heat lamps are wonderful. This incredible light fixture here spans over the two main rooms um, here at the Centurion Lounge. And it is made to resemble a forest canopy and it is really beautiful. Uh, it sheds just a very, very nice light. Uh, it really adds to the ambiance here. And here we are. There's a beautiful olive tree I've heard about a giant, huge live olive tree in the center of this bigger room over here by the buffet. Again, we've got our fruit and some um, crudite, waters, iced teas. I don't think this is the full buffet yet. This lounge truly is huge. Just so many places to sit. Here is one of the bars. I understand that all of the drinks here are complimentary. Music changes are everything. And there's no witnesses. <laughs> Over here is the buffet. The menu here has been designed by Deborah Van Trees. She's a local Atlanta chef and artist. Um, she has designed a menu of global soul food and I have just tried it and it is wonderful. I really enjoy it. Here's a tar grilled chicken with green tomato chimichurri. Her black eyed pea birani is really wonderful. Spicy, but I absolutely love that. And comes with some traditional braised greens and treats.
truly delicious cornbread. Sides include your macaroni and cheese, your jalapeno hoe cakes, and desserts, looks like lemon bars and cookies. And over here, we have some cold items. We've got a salad and cheeses, different meats laid out. Over here, you've got vegetables of all sorts and some dips, crudite, potato chips, uh, little pita breads. And here's a view of this main room with the bar and your, and your buffets as well as here is part of the vegan and vegetarian offerings. It is a wellness menu that includes pineapple and peach juice, strawberry banana smoothies, uh, vanilla peach overnight oats with cardamom, and whole fruit, um, mandarin oranges, etc. Some of this is gone. They don't think they have put it back out maybe since breakfast. And then these over here are supposed to be um, like health juices or health wellness shots. Again, very nice selection of tea. There is even honey included for the tea. A wonderful menu. I'm going to give this a try right now. These are nice hot mugs, which I absolutely love. And we are gonna try their decaf espresso. There we go. And we're done. All right, so now we're back over here. This is where I initially came in. I'm heading up towards the check-in just to bring you back down this hall here. Brought you back. Here's where we entered. And we're gonna come around. This is that room with the olive tree. You have a 50-year-old olive tree that's been brought in. Evidently, Atlanta is a city of trees. A lot of the touches here are local touches. And here is, I believe, the only whiskey bar. This is the reserve by American Express. So the smaller bar is more dedicated to your whiskey cocktails. They have five specialty cocktails here on the menu that focus on whiskey. And again, another connection to Atlanta and to the southern United States. And here is another one of the terraces. This one's quieter. This does not overlook the runways, but it has greenery. It's just really lovely out here. Beautiful day today in the 60s. Even walk down this way. There's another little outdoor sitting area in there. And all these nice plants. Great break from being indoors in an airport with a long layover. All right, and let's keep going down that hall. I cannot believe the size of this lounge is fantastic. Okay, this is back, the main room with the main bar and the buffet. Here's another quieter area in here. Good place to get some work done. There's a phone room here for people wanting to do business on their phones. There's four rooms there. Okay, let us go on. Another small room, multi-purpose. Great place for a family or a little business conference. And over in the corner are the restrooms. That is the brand new Centurion Lounge. I think it's going to be an incredible addition. All of the Sky Lounges here 
in Atlanta are always so busy and I think it will be wonderful to have another option. I am going to stay here. My flight's in about two hours. Also, not only will the leave overcrowding, but for people with some of the American Express cards that are getting more limited access to the Sky Lounges, for instance, a limit next year of 10 visits, being able to access this lounge as well will help spread that out. I think this lounge will be much more crowded over time as it becomes more and more well known. How can you get into this lounge? You need to have either a American Express Platinum card or one of several of the Delta cards, um, such as the Delta uh, Business or Personal Reserve card. That is your tour of the brand new American Express Centurion Lounge, which is located at gate E11 at Atlanta's Hartfield Jackson Airport. This lounge at 26,000 square feet is the largest Centurion Lounge in the entire world. I hope you've enjoyed this tour. If you have any questions, please ask me in the comments. If you haven't yet subscribed, please give us a subscribe and a like. We do appreciate our viewers. Thank you so much. You have been watching Cruising with Dee.